Friends, it's Saturday, July 20th. The time is 7 p.m. and the temperature is 25 degrees Celsius. I'm here at the intersection of Queen and Ossington Avenue. We'll be walking north up Ossington Avenue to check out some of the nightlife. This is quite a busy, busy street here. Lots going on. There's lots of nice patios as well up this stretch. I was actually walking south down Queen, or south towards Queen rather. And I thought, I've got to record this. Just, it's a really hopping street. You can see some people here are waiting for the bus. Seems like they might have been waiting for a while there. And it's been a while since I've just done a traditional walking video. And I still want to do these in between my food reviews as well. It's a beautiful night in the city and it's so nice to see everyone out and about. Enjoying the local restaurants and bars. Just a classic summer night in the city. This place looks popular. It looks like it's faux. It's quite the spot. No, Banjo likes to hop around on your foot. We're crossing over Bruce Street here. A beautiful mural here of this dove or not a dove it's a swan <laughs> I think in a previous video I was calling geese ducks <laughs> those girls were enjoying some nice ice cream look at this patio to the left here it's pretty nice There's Kukla across the road there. Looks like another popular spot. Everyone's welcome. This is like a gag. She's coming. Lots of lineups tonight. Mindful Maelstrom. That can't be what they're lining up for. What's this place here? Ice cream and bakery. I can't say I would line up for ice cream, but if it's worth the wait, then maybe, but I can't say that's something I'm interested in. I don't really like to wait in lines unless it's something I'm really looking forward to and it's once in a lifetime opportunity, <laughs> if that makes sense. I kind of like to just grab my food and go. Another patio here, Pilot Coffee Roasters, it looks like. As well as, it's kind of hard to see the names here. It's a coffee chulos. Uh, let's just walk a block, see if we can. This is Argyle Street, we're coming up to. I noticed a couple people had a bit too much to drink. And it's only 7 p.m., as I said. Getting buzzed a bit early tonight. That's a nice patio. Bellwoods Brewery to the left. I would say Ossington Avenue competes with King and Queen for its nightlife. Nice little murals down that way as well. We've got another nice patio here. Sam James Coffee Bar, looks like. Mm, cute little doggy. <laughs> Another 
beautiful mural here. It says, act beautifully. Tailing this couple ahead of me here. I'm gonna pass them real quick. Ideal coffee and wine. We're entering a shady stretch here. The beautiful trees above us. So nice. I've got a break in patios along this stretch. big patio to the left there. Looks like that's for Vogue Vogue. Lucky's Exotic Bodega. Snacks, sneakers, drinks, lotto, smokes, and liquor. There's a look inside. Wow. Goes pretty far back there. Pete's Sierra Liberato. Street West. I think we'll hang it right here and go east. Yeah, the one that you're technically trying to This stretch of Dundas can get busy as well. Yeah. I like the Scooby Doo shirt we just saw there. Or he just doesn't feel like riding. Cute little doggy. I'm always amazed at the dogs throughout the city. They're always so well behaved. And we are officially in Little Portugal. I think as the sun continues to set here, it'll get a lot cooler. There was a nice breeze earlier. There doesn't seem to be much of one now. I did a video walking west along Dundas here over to Nova Era Bakery. I really enjoyed it. I went in and I got a cappuccino and a couple Portuguese tarts. before doing a late night live stream as well. 
before filming this, I just fin finished up my pizza video as well. So there's Trinity Bellwoods Park. And I believe that is one of the parks that you can drink in. There's about 45 parks throughout the city that you can bring an alcoholic beverage to and enjoy it in the park. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe that's one of them. <laughs> you got some bikers up ahead here. I think they're gonna go and return their bikes. You can rent bikes throughout the city and get to and from places fairly quickly. We're crossing over Crawford Street. There's a streetcar coming here. It's the 505 Dundas, headed to Dundas West Station. That has it looks pretty busy in the park this evening. And the Honda Indy is also on this weekend as well. Maybe I'll go and check it out or try to get close. You used to get a pretty good view of the Honda Indy. Not so much anymore from what I've read. There's the 505. That one's headed to Broadview Station and another 505 to Dunbass West Station. But yeah, as I was saying, I think they blocked off getting a clear view of the Honda Indy. there years ago with my mom and we went on a Friday and it's free free admission on Fridays and they still had the same this year so yesterday was the free day I wonder if it was packed <laughs> That lady had a nice camera. What kind of vintage? Some beautiful flowers just to the right here. Mm, they smell even better. We're continuing east along Dunbass Street West. I think we'll go for a couple more blocks here. And I'll start to wrap up the video and probably fire up my live stream shortly after that. With all of the recording I've done beforehand, I'll have to stop at a coffee shop and charge up. <laughs> On these hot days, believe it or not, it still drains the battery quite a bit. Two pies and the I would say it, ha it would have to be a little bit cooler than this in order for it to keep its charge. We're putting our devices through a lot during the heat waves we've been having. There's another patio here. this motorcycle up ahead there. It's got a sidecar. That's cool. There he goes. And we're going to cross
cross over Bellwoods Avenue. Hopefully. That guy seems very eager. Northern Bell Bar. There's a laundromat. <laughs> and we are in the Trinity Bellwoods neighborhood. Neat little alleyway there. I actually enjoy walking this stretch at night as well. I've done a couple live streams through here. We're making a left turn here. We might be waiting a while here. This is Claremont Street. I'm going to cross over while I can. Looks like they were able to make that left turn safely, so that's good. It's always quite risky turning left. Here we have a 7-Eleven. And here we are at Manning Avenue and Dundas. You know what, I'm just gonna go for it here. I didn't see any cars coming. All right, I hope you enjoyed this Saturday evening walk, checking out the patios along as Ossington, Ossington Avenue, <laughs> and along Dundas as well. Feel free to give the video a like, subscribe, leave a comment, let me know your thoughts. I also have an Instagram account. It's Walks with T-Shods as well as a Twitter, which is also Walks with T-Shods. If you're interested in becoming a member, there's a join button. button. <laughs> join button next to the subscribe button as well as a link below in my description crossing over Euclid Avenue all right thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you next time